Okay, so my plan is... Oh, there you are. <laughs> I freaked out. I forgot that they were there. Alright. Really? I'm just going to die. That's all I'm going to do. I lost, like, my one city of a name, and then I got, like, Kolkata. So I guess that's nice. Um, really, all I am going to be doing is just fighting and fighting and fighting, and I'm going to lose. So hard. In 19, um, in 1960, I was playing as Thailand, and I really just, I, re I was, I wasn't really failing. I just kept on getting wrecked by, like, Australia, and it was just bad. I'm not sure what I should be doing, so I'm going to go over here. Um, yep, that area is screwed. I'm going to continue fighting this area, known as India, and <laughs> hopefully take it over. Because I need more cities if I'm going to plan on making more troops. I can't just continuously live off that one city. I am talking a lot more than I usually do. <laughs> and of course, for whatever reason, whenever I play 1950, um, Germany just keeps on getting, like, they're just sort of there, because the AI don't normally attack the gray countries. Um, but it, Germany just, like, after, like, round, like, ten, it just... Oh. Iran is attacking. Alright, anyway, they just sort of, like, like, skip it, but, like... Their cities are still there. So, their just borders are just, like, gone. Like, they have, like, no borders anymore. I am weird like that. Whenever I take over the world, I love my country to be connected. This area and this area are annoying me so much and this island being so far away from my main country is also annoying me a lot um but i guess i'm just ocd like that i don't actually have ocd i'm lying completely i know that ocd is a real problem um so yes it looks like oh japan already i mean not japan japan would never do that japan is my friend you got my back. But uh, China took my fortress already. So now I just have Kolkata. That's all I have. So I guess I need to take over India. That's fun. I also need to keep my borders from being taken over by um, China. China's being mean. China's always mean to me. Whenever I play as, like, India, I always get wrecked by China. I hate it so much. It's not fun. You guys can't judge me, because you guys have never been attacked by China. If you guys were ever attacked by China, then you, you would know. Because being attacked by China is not fun. Luckily, they're going to go after Yangon, and then they're going to go after Kolkata. So I have to take over Numbai very fast. England is still over here nuking people. That's not good for the environment. Neither is war, really. Or anything that humans do. Humans should really just stop. They're not nice. Luckily, this thing is going to be taken out a lot faster because... Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Alright, I'm just... Grant continues to send troops, and oh my god, don't you dare. I know what you are doing. Don't stop that. I will kill you. Dead. You'll be killed dead. Um, I guess I'll just at continuously attack that city and hope that I don't get completely wrecked by China, like I've been doing so long. That's all I do with my life. I just keep on getting attacked by China and losing... You don't win against China. That's the one rule of war. Okay, luckily this thing is going down really fast. So, yeah, there we go. Now the city's pretty much mine. My troops staying over here is fine. 
because I don't lose money for anything unless I actually pay for troops. So saving up my money is going to help with future operations. Um, but we're sort of in that sticky situation with these troops starting to take over my city, and I just want to take over this city, and they won't let me, and they're being mean, and blah, blah. People just can't leave me alone. I just want to live my life in peace, and they won't let me. Alright, I guess I'll just continue. See? I told you. England just nuked Bangkok. I'm telling you, England will not stop nuking people. Also, I want to take over Bangkok. That's a really good city for creating troops. You can create, like, tanks and stuff. Alright, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be able to take the city. Ta-da! I got the city. Okay, this is going to be a problem. Considering they only have assault infantry. And they suck. Like, really bad. They're not very good. At all. If I had a better ship, I could be able to just place it next to the Kolkata and just defend it. But my ship only shoots things that are directly next to it, and that's not going to be much help. Um, because it's not a destroyer. I forgot what it is. Um, I need a battleship, and I have a destroyer. And I don't need a destroyer. I need a battleship. Okay, apparently my troops are so much better. Um, I did not expect that. I'm going to put that there. Oh, apparently that makes me money. I did not know that. In the future, I'll be able to make sure that I take over all of the ports. Because they're free. I can even take over my friend's ports. The weird thing is that I've found is that if people come into your territory, if they're your friends, you can't attack them. Like, I, like, whenever I play as, like, I played as Poland once, and I just kept on getting annoyed because Soviet, the Soviets would not stop coming into my country. They, they came into their country anyway, as you can see, they're all over the place. And this is what I hate when I play this game, is that sometimes my allies would not stop coming into my country, and it just makes me really, really mad for some reason whenever my country is never connected. I really don't know why. But I am just crazy. Alright, Numbai. Oh, that's exactly the same as Kolkata. I thought it was better. I thought you were better than this, Numbai. Uh, I'm going to take over New Delhi. Because I can. After I deal with this stupid person coming into my territory. So, what are you doing, dude? Not being nice. This is the best I've ever done with 1950s ROTC. I mean, not ROTC. ROC. I have never made it this far. Like, I've always just, like, lost my main islands, then lost my thing, and then I died on, like, round 8. But, uh, hey, it's round 18, I'm still here. Um, I don't know what to do now. I mean, I know I'm attacking Numbai, but, I mean, New Delhi, I already took over Numbai. Um, but... The problem is, New Delhi is in the middle, and my ship is not able to get it. So that sucks as well, but if I ever, if I take over New Delhi, then I get all of India. And India's pretty big. And considering what I started out with, that's pretty good. Um, of course the ROC hates China, because China took over all their territory, and the, uh, the history stuff. But you guys don't know history because you're stupid. That's right. I went there. I only get 58 coins every time. Someone take over Kolkata. No one even took over Kolkata. I went mad. I am going to set up my troops so I can attack Yangon. Like, immediately. So how... C wait, how come these guys can just take over Chinese assault infantry? But... These guys who are assault infantry cannot take out the I Iran light infantry. I really don't understand the logic behind that. But I'm going to kill them and dead because they deserve it. Because they're the enemies. And enemies are not good. 
We, should, we could all just have been friends. All of you red people. We could have been friends and we could have helped each other. None of our people would be starving, but you guys want to be greedy. Especially you, Koreas. I'm not happy with you. Oh, crap, they both fell. Huh. I was not expecting that. I thought that North Korea would still be standing, but nope. They both died. I was not paying attention, obviously. Um... Or it happens whenever I was not looking. That also could have happened. Because of things. And the fire looks like my person is on fire. I mean, the bubble thing. Not my actual person. Ah, I was going to take over Yang on, but these guys moved. They're smarter than me, obviously. I always underestimate the machines. But I always have to remember that computers are stinking perfect, and humans are not. I don't like humans. Never have. Alright. Let's see. I have four people over here. I mean, two people over here, two people over here. Um, nobody down here at all. Um, but I don't need people down here, because I want to attack New Delhi. I also want to attack this, and this, and this. And this and this and this. Really just everything that has red on it. Mm. I'm going to move this thing down here so I can attack Yangon. That, Yangon is my next target. Then it's La La Lhasa. And then my old territory. And then I'll move my way to Hanoi and then Bangkok. Because Bangkok is a very good city. Um, I have no idea how good Lisa is. That could be capable of spawning super tanks. Um, but I have no money to, to pay for super tanks. Or else I would have super tanks. I don't understand why Sky does Minecraft music he's on playing in the background. This is so stupid. I hate waiting for them to do their thing. Oh my god, Japan was defeated! No! No! R.I.P. Japan. My friends, you will forever be missed. I wanted to live in Japan for the longest time. Now I kind of just want to visit it. I don't really want to live there. Oh, I can't attack him from there. And I can't undo that. Oh, crap. Alright. They're not going to attack me anyway. So might as well just... Right, that was kind of suicide for stupid. Alright, um... Numbai and Kolkata suck. I expected better. Alright, I'm just going to surround New Delhi. And then attack it. Because I can. And my lips are getting dry. Oh yeah. Alright. We attack the enemy. The horizon. Singapore is also really good. But they're not very... I mean, Singapore is good for missiles. Because they can launch missiles. And that's a wonderful thing when it comes to warfare. And waffles. And all that cool stuff. That's pretty good. What time is it? It's 8.29. No, my my guy fell. He died. He slipped on a banana peel. That's not good. Slipping on banana peels is not good for your health. Remember that, kids. Don't do bananas. Stay in New Delhi. I don't know. Stay in places of your imagination just like Willy Wonka said I'm still mad at China for taking over Japan I am so mad I'm also mad at China for taking over North Korea I mean not North Korea I, I hate North Korea North Korea is so stupid South Korea is what I meant I like South Korea now Samsung will never reinvent it and I can never do videos because I don't know what Mobison does on the iPhone I really don't like iPhone. It's not very good. I mean, it is very good. It's 
But I just like Samsung better. And people yell at me for liking Samsung better. It was, it's just like, can I like who I like? I can have opinions of my own. I am very opinionated. That's one thing that I've learned about myself. I have too many opinions. What is going on in the world? Egypt is doing okay. Soviet Russia is doing good. China is still being a jerk as usual. What do you do to China? I liked China. Alright, pee my friend. Alright, um, let's... North Korea is going crazy. I mean, not North... I keep on saying North Korea because I keep on forgetting that there's a South Korea. And I always feel like North is always better than South, but not when it comes to Korea. Alright. I am still going to mourn Japan. Moment of silence. As we wait for these idiots to do their thing. America, Canada, Mexico, Brazil, China. I know all the countries. This is Saudi Arabia and Iraq and will be Syria, but it's night now. Egypt, this right here, I, f what is that? I Italian, Gotti. All right, I know all my countries. Still mad about Japan. All right, this is the last thing that these guys will ever do. Goodbye. Mmm. Attacking them smart. No. That's just great. Now I'm left with Numbai. Numbai sucks. I don't understand what's with Numbai. It's just bad. Really bad. All bad. Not good. Always bad. After this turn, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys for watching so much. Or, you don't guys, you don't watch so much. We need to hit, like, a million subscribers in, like, the first three days. Even though I don't really deserve it. <laughs> Whatever. Nah, I lost Kolkata. And, yeah, thanks for watching. I will see you guys later. Goodbye, dudes. You guys are fantastic.